What's up everybody, welcome back here on the channel. Today we're gonna take a look at three brand new 2024 Hot Wheels Premium Car Culture Team Transport sets. Let's take a look at the back side of one of our sets and as you can see all three sets belong to one case and I think it's the first time this year that I ordered a whole case of Hot Wheels Premium models because I didn't want to miss out um, on one of these sets in the store because I think they are pretty nice. This is a new casting. Here we got a very cool deco. And this is also a special casting. And uh, yeah, I would say let's get started with this one right here. Um, as you can see, this is the Sauber Mercedes C9 with the Fleet Flyer. And I did a whole separate video about this set. I'll put a link to that in the description below. So, um, here is the set and only a few words. Um, yeah, this is a very, very nice casting. It's the third version of this casting. As you can see, it comes with an opening uh, part and these uh, lens headlights, which is pretty cool. And the special thing about this Sauber Mercedes C9 is um, you couldn't get one of these premium versions in a single pack. You always had to buy, uh, I think the other two versions were in diorama sets or in, in this case, it's uh, yeah, this team transport set. And it's a pretty nice version. Um, the only thing which is not that good is that our um, hauler here isn't Mercedes branded. That would have been yeah, very cool, our fleet flyer here. So, uh, yeah, I don't know, maybe some licensing problems. But anyways, let's put this guy to the side. And once again, if you want to see the whole video about this thing, put a link in the description below. So now, uh, let's go on with this set right here. As you can see, it's the 1966 Porsche 906 Carrera 6. Um, yeah, car that is okay in my opinion, nothing too special. Uh, somewhere on a race track. I already uh, cut this packaging open. And uh, yeah, the special thing, of course, is our um, <clears throat> Porsche model. We've seen this uh, carry on hauler several times um, so nothing special about that and as you can see one cool thing it's Porsche branded saying Porsche Porsche Rendi, Porsche Rendi. <laughs> and uh, yeah this one's um, pretty nice I'm, I'm not a huge fan of these uh, gray wheels but it is how it is as you can see the base is metal our cap here is metal the rest is plastic so let's put this thing in the background and let's take a look at our new casting. Yeah, once again, I'm not a huge fan of these um, gray plastic wheels. I don't know why they do that, especially in a premium set because they have the ability to put like, you know, a little bit of metal finish on these um, rims and it looks so much better and so much more realistic. I mean, no real car has gray plastic uh, wheels. But um, yeah, our base looks pretty nice. Metal for sure, as always on our Hot Wheels Premium models, rubber tires. Um, yeah, the deco I would say is okay. I mean, if you take, it's like always, you know, if you take a close look, then you see some uh, pixels, the number here, it's a little bit um, yeah, blurry if you take a close look. The headlights don't look too great, but I mean, yeah, it's okay. Rolls perfectly. Uh, yeah, sometimes I always complaining about this. Um, these models have some and little chips or yeah, scratches on their, their windshields, which is a little bit disappointing. Not too big of an issue. 
but um, yeah, there we go. And then we have this set. And uh, by the way, um, if you buy a whole case of these team transport sets, then um, there are four sets in one case, and there are two Porsche models in it and one Mercedes and uh, yeah, one Honda Accord. Uh, this is my personal favorite. I'm a huge fan of Ready and Racing Deco and yeah, this thing is really decoed up. So let's take it out of its packaging. Background again. There we go. So uh, this one here comes with uh, Fleet Street. I always mix these up. The Fleet Flyer and the Fleet Street sounds so similar. Yeah, it comes with these grim green rims and uh, yeah, a lot of Castrol deco, and that is really really cool on the side on the front. That's a lot, of course, you can move this part so that we can drive our Honda here on the back and load it up. Um, yeah, you know, it's, um, normally it detaches very easily. It could be a little better on a premium model. But anyways, let's take a look at... Uh, our 96 Honda Accord. Yeah, love the deco on this thing. Um, I'm not really sure if they hit the, the colors right. The, the red looks a little bit, you know, light. Maybe this is intended. I, yeah. I'm not familiar with the uh, real car, so I can't tell you that. And another thing is that the wheels do sit very, very far in. Maybe that is intended, I don't know. Once again, I don't know anything about the original race car, but the deco looks pretty good. Get this metal wing with Kestrel on it. We get some windshield banners and yeah, a lot of deco. And as you can see, there's a roll cage inside and we also get some uh, uh, exhaust details in chrome deco on the back on the front. As always, I think these prints could be a little better. You always can see the pixels if you look closely. I mean, the thing is you don't have to buy these Hot Wheels Premium models. Yeah. But, uh, you know, <laughs> if you got an addiction, you got an addiction. And I wanted to have these and I think it's a, it's a very nice set. Um, let's put our cars next to each other. I think I already mentioned it. We've, um, this is the second version in premium of this model. Uh, first one I think came out uh, last year. And uh, yeah, that's it for this video. You know, always uh, at the end, I'm trying to pick a favorite. And uh, because we've seen this thing a few times before, I would say my favorite is this one here because of its deco. Nicely done, a lot going on. And yeah, now you can tell me your opinion about these sets um, in the comments down below. Thank you for watching. Happy hunting and see you next time. Bye.